I'm William Revel, uh, and um, I'm an Emeritus Professor of Biochemistry and Public Awareness of Science Officer at University College Cork. And one of the things I do is organise an annual science public lecture series. Uh, and our 2013 series will start next week on the 16th of January. Uh, the lectures will be held in Bool 4 Lecture Theatre. The time is 8 o'clock. They're free to the public and everybody is welcome. Our first lecture on the 16th of January will be given by Professor L.K. Arendt from our Faculty of uh, Food Science and Technology. Um, like most of the lecturers, Elke is UCC, and uh, these lectures will demonstrate the cutting edge research and development that we carry out at UCC. In the first lecture, Elke will describe her work in developing novel new foods that are very useful. For example, uh, new gluten-free cereal and beer beverages, uh, development of certain pizzas and a very interesting one, the development of a biodegradable chewing gum. Now, the next lecture on the 23rd of January uh, will be given by Dr Rory O'Mahony from the Tyndall National Institute at UCC where they have developed um, micro needles. Uh, these are microscopic extremely sharp needles that will revolutionise the delivery of vaccines uh, and various medical drugs and other compounds across the skin barrier. Uh, and it, it is um, envisaged that within 10 years, this technology will replace the old needle and syringe, which is quite a painful thing as well, uh, technology for the de de delivery of vaccinations. The next lecture on the 30th of January will be given by Professor Paul O'Toole from our microbiology department. Uh, and Paul will describe um, groundbreaking research that he has carried out and recently published in the journal Nature on the effect of diet on bacteria that inhabit our gut. Uh, these bacteria have very important interactions with the body that are important for health. And the interaction of diet with the bacteria is very important for healthy ageing. On the 6th of February, we have Dr. Kevin McCarthy from the Department of Electrical Engineering. And he's going to talk about recent developments in telecommunications in Ireland. Uh, and this will cover the, uh, the various handheld devices that we all now use uh, and are dependent on, and indeed addicted to, uh, that allow us instant access to the World Wide Web. On the 20th of February, a very interesting lecture on obesity will be given by Professor Mike Gibney from the um, Institute for Food and Health at UCD. And uh, oh, the Western world is now uh, coping with, or struggling with, an epidemic of obesity. Now, unfortunately, a lot of myths have grown up about obesity and not only about obesity, but about food and nutrition in general. And in his talk, Professor Gibney will explode uh, many of these myths and talk about the poor science that has also accumulated around the whole area of obesity and diet. On the 6th of March, uh, a lecture on the use of antibiotics. Now, antibiotics are used in medicine and are essential for fighting disease in the modern world. Um, they were uh, discovered and introduced a long time ago in medicine and were magic bullets for uh, dealing with various diseases. But unfortunately they have been overused and abused and now the bacteria that they kill to cure a, a disease are becoming resistant to some of them. And this is allowing these resistant bacteria to uh, become a, a problem. The lecture on this will be given by uh, Dr. Cormac Gahan from our Department of Microbiology, and he will describe what's happening in that area. Uh, and just another example of um, a lecture is one on the 13th of March about free will. And free will is probably the, the, the final thing that we think we have as a freedom, the freedom to decide what to do. But 
Many scientists and philosophers think that what our free will is in fact an illusion. We think we have, it, have free will, but in fact we don't. So they think it's an illusion and a persistent illusion, which would be bad news if this is the case. It will be given by Professor Santiago Sia, who is a retired dean of philosophy from the Milltown Institution in Dublin. Other lectures in the series will talk about the use of biochemistry to understand the basis, chemical basis for disease, and there's also a talk on uh, providing a reliable electricity supply in Ireland using renewable energy sources like wind. Um, as I said at the start, the lectures start on the 16th of January. Uh, they will be held in Bool 4 Lecture Theatre every Wednesday night at 8pm and they're free to the public and we'd like everybody to come. The, all the lectures will be filmed and will be posted on the UCC Understanding of Science website and indeed all our past um, films are hosted on that site um, also. So um, please come and enjoy the lectures, um, that's what they're there for.